Madam Speaker, I rise today in celebration of Filipino Independence Day. The history of Filipino independence is the story of a people who remained tirelessly committed to the democratic values of self-determination and freedom, even amidst the most challenging circumstances. On June 12, 1898, the Philippines declared their independence after a long history of occupation. However, the country remained a territory of the United States for many years, even after Congress enacted the Philippine Independence Act of 1934. It wasn't until the 4th of July in 1946, when President Harry S. Truman issued Proclamation 2695 that the United States recognized Filipino sovereignty, officially making, marking the nation's independence. Both during and since its independence, the Philippines has been one of the United States' most important allies. My district in Southern California is home to around 30,000 Filipinos. They are an integral part of our communities, touching every aspect of our way of life with an entrepreneur spirit, a respect for their traditions, and a love for America. I am proud to represent them in the United States Congress, and I will always fight for a better life for them and for all of my constituents. To the Filipino community in Southern California and across the country, I wish you a very happy Independence Day. Thank you, and I yield back.